Hello everyone, this is BioResi and welcome to another My Collection video on Resident Evil Biohazard. Now as you can see, today we're going to be looking at the Resident Evil 4 Limited Edition GameCube. Here we go, look at it in all of its glory. And um, today we've got a bit of a helper today. He hasn't been here for, he hasn't done a video with me for a few weeks now. But he's back, Little Tyrant. Say hello. You're missing a tooth, aren't you? Oh. But, um, and plus he's been infected with the G virus, haven't you? So he's slowly mutating a little bit. He's got a giant eye growing here. And, um, but he should be okay for the next 10 minutes, shouldn't you? <laughs> okay. So, here's the front of the box. Have a little look. Now this has been opened, because, but I haven't actually, I don't use it anymore. Um, so I just keep it in the box. So I'll just move it around. I mean, it's in pretty cool condition. But, uh, to be honest, I wasn't collecting it years ago, so I kind of wish when it came out, I bought one just to keep sealed, but, oh well. At least I've got one. Here's some of the writing on the back, and um, let's have a look. You think you know horror? You think you know Resident Evil? Think again. Um, obviously it comes in all different languages. This was a PAL release. Got some pictures on the back here. Pretty strange that they used the same picture twice. You, you would think that they would put a different one in. And you got random leaves. And there's Leon again, and we'll keep moving it around. And these are the accessories that come with the GameCube. And on the top, we got a cool looking picture there of some of the enemies in the game. That tells you what's in it. So, we're going to open this and start taking some of the stuff out and have a little look. Now, as you can see, actually, that side is still sealed. So we're going to go into this way. I'm just going to tip it on its side here. Now, I haven't got the insert for the box anymore. So it's all kind of, but it's all kind of in neatly and it's all in good condition. Here is your leads for the back. Um, it's not the best quality leads, uh, I have to say, for GameCube. There is a... No, God, uh, yeah, I'm going to go technically and probably fail. But there is a better one. I don't know if it's VGA or R RBG. Oh, I can't remember. I'd have to look into it. But there is a one that gives you a better image quality. But this is just like your standard one. that Three colours or goes... Three colours go into like a Scott lead. Um, is the pad. As you can see, it's in pretty cool condition. I'm just going to unravel it a little bit so you can have a look. So I'll try, try not to shake it. In fact, do you want to do that for me, little tyrant? Can you unravel that for me? And I'll pull some other stuff out. Right. Here's your power brick. Nothing too um, spectacular here. Now, let's have a look what's in here. We got, still got all the paperwork with it. Interestingly, you got this one here, which is my fingers over the screen. Um, this was like a bonus disc that come with it. Let me just take it out. Here we are. Um, I can't actually remember. It was a limit. It was a bonus disc. I think it's got the making on it. I'm just looking at the side of the box. It's been a while since I looked at it. It's got the making um, video of previous Resident Evil games, and it's got a exclusive demo version. But yeah, that comes in that, that little uh, little pouch that it slides in. Uh, next time, next time, actually. Um, in fact, little Tyrant's got a Wii, haven't you, upstairs? And um, he, us he uses um, 
the GameCube sometimes on it because sometimes he plays on some of the old Resident Evil ones. And he's got the you new know, like the original Wii with him, um, and it's got like obviously of course it's got like GameCube um, memory card slots and stuff like that on the top. Um, I don't know if there's anything else Resident Evil related. Let's have, oh, we got one here. We got uh, our VIP points here. Um, they have been redeemed. There you go. And we got poster. I think that's all the games were coming out at the time. <clears throat> uh, what's this one? Oh, it's a little thing for the guide. Um, there's the back. Available for March 2005. Obviously, we're filming this in. What are we now? July 2016, so. And it's just a manual. I mean, they're pretty generic. My little tyrant has been good as gold and unraveled. The pad. Here's the pad. A little bit of dirt on the yellow bit there. But apart from that, it's in pretty good condition. And um, got the Resident Evil 4 logo on there, which is pretty cool. And I've got to say, um, GameCube, one of my favorite pads of all time. And um, well, to be honest, it's one of my favorite consoles of all time. And um, I just think this pad is just an amazing, an amazing pad with the button layout and everything. <coughs> so, um, what do you think of Resident Evil 4, Little Tyrant? Do you like Resident Evil 4? What's your favorite bit? Which one? Oh, G3. Oh, the, the big, um, is it, yeah? U3. U3, isn't it, yeah? The big the big one in the cage. It's pretty cool. And you've got a few NECA toys, haven't you? You've got, you've got, um, Verdugo. Um, I'm trying to think of other Resident Evil. Oh, you got, um... Razor. Regenerator. Um, yeah, you got Regenerator. And the green one, haven't you got that new? Mm-hmm. Cool. You should go and get the green Regenerator and sure we'll add that on. Yeah, well done. The show is new little figure over there, right? And here we are. Here's the game with it. Um, I've actually got two copies of the game. So I've got one in this box that come, and I've got like the separate one because I like to keep this in the box and a bit strange like that. Um, this one, this two, or the manual. Um, let's have a look what come with this. It's got a um, VIP code. Strangely, I haven't um, done this one. And we got... It's like a postage thing. What's this for? Let's have a look. Right, fill out the details, blah, 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 blah. Capcom. Oh, latest news direct from Capcom, obviously before the internet. Put your name and stuff and then tick which one you're kind of into. Um, and it tells you what consoles were out and they, these are the ones that were out at the time what influenced you to purchase this game because it's Resident Evil you can write a little um, comment there um, obviously it was on the internet then obviously got a um, web address but I don't think many people were really on the internet I mean 2005 it was starting to take um, take shape really i mean i can't remember the last time i got i think i got my first internet around 2005 or 2006 when um, the 360 come out actually yeah i don't want to show you a little new figure um yeah you put it here look at that he's from regenerator but this is the green variant i think he looks pretty cool do you reckon we just put him next to the console when we get out <laughs> yeah why not there you go well, let's get the console out now I'll just move move the box over here and we'll put the console down and we'll put a green regenerator next to it. How's that? Does life get any better than a Resident Evil 4 GameCube console and a green regenerator? In fact, let's put them on it. Look at King of the console. Oh yeah? 
So on the console, I mean it's so small when, when I hold this still. Um <clears throat> there we go, the silver. Same same layout, power, reset, um, open. I, I always love the little handle, especially love this silver um edition. I think it was just a, a standard one that come out roughly the same time, but obviously it never had the Resident Evil 4. Uh, Capcom Limited. But yeah, it looks, looks so cool. Not in it, but still works. Here's your four slots in your memory card. And yeah, so there you have it. Um, one of my all time favorite consoles, to be honest, GameCube. I absolutely, I mean, I've always been a Resident Evil fan. And when this came out, and you and you had like a Resident Evil Zero remake four, and then you had two, three, and Code Veronica. It was just an amazing, amazing thing to play. Um, we'll do a nice little um, final showing of everything in it. Here's the game. Here we go. And that's it. That's my Resident Evil Four console. Um, I don't think I'll ever get rid of this. I mean, it's just, I'll say it's probably my favourite console of all time. The memories were just amazing. Do you think we should get rid of it, little tyrant? Mm -hmm. No. We like this one, don't we? Mm -hmm. And um, and we've got an additional green <laughs> regenerator in the back. But um, yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. Um, please um, subscribe to the channel. Drop a comment. Like the video. Always like to hear some feedback or, do I mean, just want to chat or anything else that you'd like to see in the channel or any ideas or suggestions, always welcome. Um, I'm Bio Resi, this is a little tyrant, and I um, hope you have a nice day and see you soon. Bye-bye.